okay, before I start this video, I just want to point out, <gasps> look, I made more adjustments. Hey fellow reading warriors and welcome to today's video. So today's video is super fun. I'm really excited to do it. I'm doing the small booktuber tag. I wasn't tagged by anyone, but I really wanted to do this tag, especially since when I first started off my channel. I never actually did the newbie booktuber tag, and I feel like I've been book I've been on booktube too long to do the newbie booktuber tag because I'm not new anymore. Um, so I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna do the small booktuber tag and we're we're gonna call it good. So the first question on the uh, small booktuber tag is to introduce yourself. And so Hi, I'm Laura. I'm from the Midwest in the United States. Um, I am currently a college student living with my husband in a tiny apartment. And other hobbies other than reading and writing, I do also like to write, include, well, I like to bake, except I haven't been doing a lot of baking because our small Ricky Dink apartment has a sliver of a kitchen and it's a pain to clean. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping, hoping that in our next apartment will have a better kitchen so I can actually do some good baking and I kind of want to incorporate that into my videos a little bit, kind of do some bookish themed baking. And if you haven't seen my last video, then you don't know that I, my husband and I actually started an indoor garden, which is super exciting. And so that's starting to be a new habit of mine, kind habit, hobbit, hobbit of mine, <laughs> I wish, habit of mine. Um, but otherwise, yeah. I'm an English major. I, I'm really into books and that kind of rules my life. So that's me. If you do want to know more about me, um, more than what I say in this video, I did do the booktube about me tag um, a few months ago and so I'll have that down in the description. The second question is how long have you been on booktube? I've been on booktube since July 2, 2019. That's when I uploaded my very first video. The thing is, is that I was not posting consistently at the very beginning. I would like post a video when I had material to do so or I felt like doing it or I had time to do it. Um, it was very sporadic and it was right and I started posting right before the reading rush and so I had a lot of like reading rush videos and then I had like a small break and it just it was kind of all over the place. I didn't start posting regularly every Thursday until the end of last year, middle end of last year, couple months, maybe like the last quarter, last third of the yeah, last quarter of the year, last couple months. Um, <laughs> that was a way long-winded explanation that <laughs> was unnecessary but basically I've been on booktube for almost two years it'll be two years this July which seems like a long time question number three what kind of videos do you make so I make a lot of the generic booktube videos you know like TBRs uh, recent reads or wrap-ups vlogs <laughs> reviews um, but I'm hoping to make more unique content. I'm hoping to do more interesting reviews. What I'm hoping to do is to have uh, a vlog review of one specific book, unless I'm doing a bunch of books that have something in common. Um, but I also am looking into creating more newer kind of creative content that is still bookish, but um, maybe isn't just always sitting down talking about a specific book or um, a couple of books that I have read, but doing more like activities or making it just a little bit more interesting Hopefully kind of like what I said earlier about like bookish baking. Yeah, I'm also really I, I'm into cosplaying, but I haven't done it a lot So I kind of want to do a more modernized version of cosplaying bush, bookish characters and incorporating them into my life and Kind of making videos based off of that. So if that's something that sounds interesting comment down below I'm still kind of working at the mechanics of it but I, it's something I'd be very interested in doing, so... Yeah! <laughs> Question number four. What do you love about booktube? Oh, there are so many things I love about booktube. But a lot of it has to do with, like, the people. Um, I've been able to start making some friends on booktube, and, like, there are booktubers who I watch, and I comment on their videos, and they will comment on mine, and it's so sweet. Um, 
but it's also the place where I get most of my book recommendations is on booktube so it's very helpful for that I, I'm just I'm much more of like an auditory visual person rather than like like a reading person which is very interesting for a reader um, but yeah so that's I like getting a lot of my recommendations off of booktube um, I'm sure I would love book talk if I ever got on it but I also know it would consume my life and I can't afford that right now so that's why I'm not on book talk question number five what type of books do you read I read lots of fantasy not really a lot of sci-fi I'm not big into sci-fi, but I've been really getting into like mythology type reads. I also love historical. I'm like pointing to the different sections on myself. I'm into like historical fiction as well. Um, I I keep saying I don't like contemporary, and then I'm got, not gonna read contemporary. And then every once in a while, I find myself reading a contemporary because a lot of the booktubers that I watch read contemporary. And every once in a while, there'll be one that just captures my interest. So like, I don't read contemporary, but like I read contemporary. I'm hoping to get into more horror or thriller-esque books. Um, I think those would be interesting. But yeah, for now, it's mostly a lot of fantasy and historical fiction. Question number six. What is your favorite video that you've made? This is a tough question. Because I feel like, I feel a couple of things. One, like most of my videos are pretty bland, pretty generic in terms of content. Like they're all like, monthly wrap-ups or all of last year I spent reading a different genre every month and I really liked doing that but there wasn't one that was like more fun over the other so I think the most fun one for me to film has been like my recent reorganization of my bookshelves as well as the moving vlogs into this apartment but I think the most interesting and most creative one to watch was the African literature video that I did with my husband where we talk about like the history of African literature, we give some recommendations and things like that. Plus it was really fun to just like not be the only person in my video. Uh, yeah, and I'll have the links to all these videos down below if you're interested in watching them. And then who do I tag? There are a couple people I would like to tag. First off being Paulina's Pages. I love her videos. She does a lot of really creative content. And I'm also going to tag The Enchanted Reader. Uh, she just hosted like a huge readathon and it was so much fun. So I'm tagging her and then I'm also tagging Annalisa Ellie? Ely? I don't know how to say her last name. Annalisa. Um, so yeah, those are the people that I'm tagging. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up, comment down below any questions you have or any creative bookish content ideas that you have or if any of the ones that I talked about in this video that seemed interesting like if they sparked your interest let me know also feel free to follow me on all my other social media accounts I have a Twitter which I am kind of active on but I'm pretty active on my bookstagram and that's kind of where I will ask also for video content ideas as well um, and I kind of give more detailed updates on what I'm currently reading and I give long reviews on there as well. So, yeah, follow those. Those will also be in the link in the description. Otherwise, subscribe if you're new here and any of this sounds interesting. Um, I kind of listed off a lot of genres as what I read. I am a huge, huge mood reader, so that even that even expands across genres, so that's going to be very interesting. But subscribe if any of this sounds interesting. I post every Thursday. And until I see you all in the next video, I wish you all a happy reading.